In this video, we're going to combine this toy car with this Raspberry Pi. We're going to add the Raspberry Pi to this. Now we're going to use a Pi 4. What I've done is I've printed bricks. They're going to have threaded inserts here. So I've got to add some threaded inserts without breaking anything. Let's give this a try. All right, that one broke. So these are M 2.5 bolts and threaded inserts. Technically not you're supposed to use a hammer to ins install threaded in inserts. You're supposed to use soldering iron it has a heat insert. At this point, not all of the electronics that are on here is, are going on this. And in fact, that one changed the Pi 4 change. So, or Pi 0 changed to a Pi 4. Of this, we're missing the voltage regulator, although we're going to be going with a much smaller one. That's a 15 amp. We only need a three and a half amp, I think, what I'm using. Um, we need this line level reducer and and the Arduino, but we're gonna we're gonna build a PCB board that'll go on top of here, connecting all this up much 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 easier. Now the wires get funneled through there. I'd originally planned, but this doesn't hold down well enough, and I, I need it to hold better. So, here is here is the thought process. So these these are supposed to mount right there, but we can't have the electronics flying off like ever. There's these holes in here that we can pin to. So if I have a brick like that, you can I reduced it by going straight on there, but it dawned on me that we can have, instead of a, a regular brick and a, oops, that should be square, um, and a little threaded insert thing, um, that we can combine these two a little bit. This is a standard three height, so if we just do a, a two height and then a plate, but put the hole right there, because that's the same height as that, then it's a little funny on the other side. We can make that work. So, you know, that would look like like that, but with a hole. So 
So I 3D printed that up and there's one of those. Now these parts are these rubbery things. I'm not sure I really like the rubbery. I like it a little bit because it's hard to get in there, but that's a little bit more rubbery than what I wanted. And I, I'm trying to not use these pins that have a uh, half, half shaft, I guess is what that's called. Um, I like the regular pins, these, those kinds of regular pins. So I modeled up a piece and printed it in TPU. Um, it's just a connector. And so let's install that here. There's the pie. It can't actually come off. Yeah, next time we'll put the PCB board on and together. I hope you enjoy. Mm -hmm.